Jack is home from the military. In his hometown and with his girlfriend and he walks up to that news anchor from the local station. He's watched on the news for years. And his girlfriend makes a phone video as he asks that news anchor. Why aren't you covering this? And he makes a phone call with his phone as the girlfriend makes a cell phone video. Of Jack's phone not working when he calls this man right here, John Milton Brady, in front of that World Trade Center fire engine. And Jack does not reach me. He makes a video, his girlfriend makes a video of whatever he gets when he doesn't get me. And he asks that network, well, not network, local news anchor. You can do this with the network once too. He asks him, why aren't you covering this? How can we trust anything you're giving us, have given us, or will give us? One something every American can cover with their cell phone is not being covered. Check and post like Jack and his girlfriend Jessica are doing. Check and post in 5 424 You're calling John Melton Brady. He hasn't gotten a World Trade Center Flight 93 check in the over seven years he's been asking. That's me. Check and post in 5 from all military bases. Call not only in front of that uh, anchor, every reporter, every mayor, every governor. Get everyone weighing in on how they feel about very managed religious censorship in America. Then come see me. You see someone other than me, my changing eyes on this chest here. DVDs, the binder art in the back of this wheelchair. We started building Jesus' this house. Come tell me what you think about it. Jack can't do that. He has to do that in person. Well, he's busy, but he can't call me up and tell me what he believes. You can't either. Do that in person. It's the way around religious censorship of the son of a carpenter married me. That's the way around Barack Hussein, Obama's religious censorship of Jesus' house.